It is widely believed that mRNA is unstable and degrades easily. This belief comes from comparing mRNA to DNA, which is widely known to be stable at room temperature, not as sensitive to changes in storage conditions, and not as susceptible to temperature-related degradation as mRNA under similar conditions. While it is true that mRNA requires some additional care, it is not as burdensome as word of mouth suggests. We're here to debunk the myth and ease your concerns about working with mRNA. mRNA is degraded by RNases, enzymes, that break the bonds to the backbone of the nucleic acid strand. In the past, the abundance of RNases in laboratory work environments was a major concern. Now, with the availability of commercial reagents rather than laboratory-prepared reagents and RNase-free tips, modern labs do not face as many RNase issues. In addition, proper handling and storage at minus 80 degrees Celsius is important and will help ensure that mRNA doesn't degrade. When using mRNA, thaw and keep on ice during use. Make small aliquots to avoid multiple freeze-thaw cycles. Protein expression following transfection can also be adversely affected by poorly handled and degraded mRNA and poorly handled lipofectamine messenger max transfection reagent. So just a few simple precautions can help ensure mRNA stability. Use RNA's free reagents and tips. Aliquot and store mRNA at negative 80 degrees Celsius and keep mRNA on ice when in use. Therefore, if you store mRNA properly and use the proper transcription kit, you can effectively transfect primary cells and slow dividing cells.